All right, we have the uh, real sense tracker. Um, and this is the uh, visualization of the sort of position and orientation of the tracker. Uh, so we can move it around, look around the scene. It should handle itself pretty well. Now if we bring it back to its rest point, which is back here on the laptop's edge. So it's it sort of there. Now let's move around. See how much drift we're gonna get come back to the same point. So you can see there's a reasonable amount of drift there. So during that yellow phase, we lost tracking, and that's really that wall <laughs> there. So similar limitations to the, um, I got back there pretty well that time. I said you can go into yellow. Yeah. So it's really uh, dependent on having a few features there. I probably yep, went red. So we'll give it a, uh, a good test run. Um, Yeah, interesting. So as long as I, as long as I keep pointing towards something that has a few little marks on it, or I put a, maybe a few sticky notes on the wall, um, you know that's returning to home pretty darn well. As soon as I sort of wave it around this wall here, where there are zero features, uh, yeah, tracking gets lost. So uh, same limitations as every other slam camera, but. Um, Certainly looks, you know, to be doing a pretty decent job, seeing as that's all um, on board. Cool.